Hey everyone, so we're going to make a periodic table of candy. So you have all of these different types of candies on your paper. Um, you've got gummy bears and M&Ms and candy corn, gummy worms, heart candy, the kind you get at Valentine's Day, candy cane, Reese cups, Twizzlers. Um, you have the gumballs, gummy drops um, or dots, jelly beans, Skittles, lollipops, assorted chocolates, caramel squares, peppermints, Snickers bars, Sour Patch Kids, Lifesavers, and then Sugar Dots. Those are just little bitty dots of sugar that come on little paper and you can peel them off and eat them. So what you're going to do is you're going to cut on the dotted line and you have all of these different types of candies. And you're going to put them into categories, okay? You need to have no less than um, four categories and no more than seven categories, okay? Um, and now these categories, remember, they're going to have similar qualities or characteristics. So if you have... Um, if you have assorted chocolates and caramel squares in the same category, then you need to have other candy in that category that is going to be similar to chocolate and caramel. Um, and you need to be able to explain why you put them in the same category. Okay, so when you get done, it's going to look very similar to this. So um, you need to put them in your own categories, you know, get creative with it. You're going to cut them and then glue them down to another sheet of paper. If you are remote, you need to take a picture of this and email it to your teacher. If you are in person, then you will just show it to your teacher while you're in class. If you have any questions, you can email me um, or you can message me through Schoology.